So this is a very important issue and you're absolutely right. We don't talk enough about the coexistence of eating disorders alongside with gender dysphoria, especially in trans fem population, but it absolutely exists in trans masculine and non-binary population as well. So eating disorders, when we don't have a very good relationship with our body, and you're not going to have a good relationship with your body if you have gender dysphoria, because how can you? You're going to have incongruency with your body, with your body image. As a result, you either going to fall into two categories. You're either going to overeat with the food in order not only to emotionally self-soothe yourself, but to also to make your body invisible by covering it up with weight, or you're going to undereat, going down to the anorexic um, type of path in order to make your body invisible now in a different way where you're almost like ghost-like and you don't exist. Very, very common, unfortunately, and tend to coexist together with gender dysphoria a lot.